Lions selection. Let's give a warm welcome because everybody wants to know what time it is. Team Export. And running out this alliance for the blue. Number six alliance. That's one of the field. It's Team 2906. Sentinel Prime Robotics. All right, we got a red light. Or, no, it's a green light. Let's go with that. <laughs> All right, the field is locked down. Looking for thumbs up from our head referee. And thumbs up from our FTA. This is the tiebreaker between the number three and the number six team for our quarterfinals. So let's get ready to kick this off. Pilots in three, two, one, launch them. Tiebreaker match for quarter nine oh four begins with 29.07, miss a line on the peg, but 488, no such trouble. X-Bot hits the blue boiler. The red boiler being pelted by 49.18 and 20.46. Bare metal and the Roboctopi gonna crank up that pressure, and we'll end up with 12 kilopascals for red and nine for blue. That translates to a 67 to 64 blue alliance deficit. Lions right themselves on the blue airship. They're matched by a gear from X-Bot. And two more Blue Alliance gears means one more rotor, and that rotor is now spinning on the Blue Airship. Bare Metal and x 488 collide as they go to collect their respective fuels now headed back. We see 2046 triggering a hopper down here near the red boiler. They're going to pick up as much of that fuel as they can and launch it in their direction. Once again, getting over that 40 kilopascal threshold will give them a 20-point bonus, and that could make the difference between these two great alliances. 90 seconds to play and just a slim nine point lead for the Red Alliance. Each Alliance with two rotors spinning and very few gears in position on that third rotor. Blue Alliance and Red Alliance each with one gear towards the third rotor. Roboctopi continuing to work on the Red Boiler as Sentinel Prime 2906 has dropped a gear in the center of the field. They're gonna go back to the blue retrieval zone and pick up a new one before they try again. Lion Robotics has a gear in their possession as they make their way past the Roboctopi to the blue airship. They drop that on the front peg and collected by the pilot. That's going to get the Blue Alliance that much closer to a third rotor as we hit 45 seconds to play. 127 to 104 is the advantage before the Red Alliance as they creep ever closer to that 40 kilopascal bonus. Up to 34, now 35 kilopascals of pressure. Blue Alliance with only 10. And they're having a hard time keeping up with the dual shooters on the number three seed. 30 seconds means the ropes drop, and as everybody heads back to their airships, we see collisions near the blue one. Our referees have waved their flags. We're going to have to sort that out. MI Robotics, the first to get up in the air. 39 kilopascals of pressure, and there is 40. The robot to have done it. 10 seconds now to get on board. Two blue robots, two red robots. Sentinel Prime joins their compatriots on the blue airship. There go the robot to pie. One second, and they've gotten there. Roboctopi able to get up on the airship, ready for takeoff, just as the buzzer sounds. We get the thumbs up from our head referee. Sounds like there's nothing new to report. So let's watch our airships lift off on the field, fly through the clouds.